You know, this Cheetos can put some pep in your step. Oops. Just built a little boot around it. Add some paint, or even better, glitter chair. And you've got new lifts. Now get stepping. On second thought, watch your step. You got paw prints everywhere, don't worry. Enough caramel can cover up any blemish. Give it time to harden and you've got candy. Add a stick and it's a lollipop. Or should we say lollipop? Done with that bottle? Good, we can recycle it. Especially that cap. Add clay and a paper dog. This ain't construction paper, color them in! For the eyes, let's go with googly. The gang's all here. Let's get rocking. They just keep going and going and going. Wow, a dog making dumplings. Eh, still better than mine. Don't worry, that's what our dumpling maker's for. All you need's the dough and filling and voila. You've got a perfectly wrapped dumpling. Wow. Careful, that might be the one with kibble. Ooh, a bone. Ooh, an even bigger bone. And ooh, a corgi? Kind of breaking the pattern. But at least he seems fun to play with. Give him a treat and watch what comes out. Ooh, careful where you're aiming that. Oh no, not the cheese puffs. I wouldn't eat that. Ew, someone get this dog a diaper. Wow, a candy machine. Looks like you've caught one. This game's a lot of fun for kids. But as for pups, not so much. But maybe then can join in on the fun. We can make our own candy machine. Just with kibble instead of candy. Press a button and the treats come pouring in. It's good thing his head fits in. Hmm, I guess someone ran out of candy. Oh no, Monica's missing. Oh, there she is. So, does this mean I get the reward? Guys, I'll get back to you. For now, let's get crafty. Next time she gets lost, she'll have an ID tag. We'll need her name and a contact number. It's kind of big. Let's shrink it down to size. Bake it in the over and bam, it's bite-sized. Just the right size to fit around her neck. <laughs> it's lunchtime. Guess someone doesn't want to share. I know, grab a pop tube and a funnel. And let the food come right to you. Use a bowl to keep everything in one place. Unless, of course, you want to eat off the floor. All done? Well, let's keep it around for dinner. I heard of dog groomers, but not like this. Oh no, you took off the whole eyebrow? It's okay, this toy has plenty of hair to share. 
He just keeps it in his blackheads. Good. It should be more than enough. But first, he really needs a shave. This is going to take a lot of shaving cream. Time for a rinse. And that's good enough. What a good boy. You've earned a treat. Ooh, a hot dog. The last food in the house. I probably shouldn't have mentioned that. It's simple solution. Just split it up. You get a piece and so do you. Hey, what about me? Mmm, pizza. Wait, watch out. Oh no. Is the pizza okay? We can rebuild it. Fry up the dough. Okay, this might take a while. Good. This face is nice and crispy. But a little makeup wouldn't hurt. No one wakes up looking their best. Take a bite. Just eat around the eyelashes. Oh no, your wig. I told you to tape it down. Don't worry, we'll make you some new hair. Cut up something purple, like onions. Just as long as she looks like an anime character. Start by whipping them up into spirals. Anyone else starting to tear up? Just me? Let's lie her down and see if we have enough. But save some too. I want onion rings. That should be enough. Looking good. Wow. So where are we on those onion rings? <laughs> Oh, even the tiniest of hearts can be broken. But don't worry, we'll make you a new friend. Literally, just need a glove, a cup, and some markers. Give it a muzzle, and soon you've got a brand new dog. Tuck it inside. Add a hole and a straw and blow it up. She's ready. Time for a meet cute. Emphasis on cute. Wow, they really like hot dogs around here. The chase begins. Get back here. Okay, now I'm starting to get dizzy. Hey, don't give up. Get crafty. Or better yet, crafting. Draw a runner in one circle and their legs in another. Cut off the tip of a straw to connect them together. Now these paper dolls will do all the running for you. Add a background and it's like you're in a cartoon. So who won? Hey, let's call it a draw. Ooh, what's in that giant block shaped box? Oh, that little shirt's sure seen better days. We can spruce it up, get out those felt tip markers. And I mean all of them, make a rainbow. Roll it up and add to water for a nice relaxing soak. Once it dries, help your furry friend become fashion forward. Careful with those paws. Don't you look cute? Well, cuter. And since you're all dressed up, let's dance. Shake that tail.
But grooming isn't entirely your pet's responsibility. Hmm. These bristles will help clean up your cat's coat. Just in time, too. Ew. With all that hair, we can make a new cat. Yuck. Told ya. Well, we've got the glove, but what about those bristles? Ah, yes, hot glue. Just remember to let it dry. Well, the cat liked it, but it didn't really do anything. The toy cat can keep this. Now your cat can spend hours trying to catch fish. Though so after teasing him like this, you owe him a nice tuna dinner. Let's see if we can make our own version of this. Besides just letting your cat near a fish tank. Of course, adding catnip sure helps. And now you've got a kitty original to hang on the wall. What a deal! Well, when it comes to your cat's litter box, it's usually for the best to splurge. Cats need their privacy after all. I wonder if they synchronize this in advance. Probably should talk to your vet about this. Ew. Yeah, let's not waste a perfectly good sock. Here's a better idea. Let's make our own private litter box. Cool. Just need to make a door in this shelf. And add litter to the bottom. Now a cat can walk in whenever they need to. Though seriously, I'd really ask your vet about your cat and produce. As always, our animal actors were real professionals. Though the human one really could have learned a thing or two from them. Animal amazing stuff, right? Catch you next time. A poor hungry puppy is looking for something. But we've got a special surprise for you. Just follow the secret doggy treat trail. <laughs> Looks like we're reaching your destination. Ooh, I wonder what Kane's up to. <laughs> After all, I don't like that look in his eyes. Don't worry, Pomni's on Puppy Patrol. Let's make like a banana and split. Ah, we're home free, without a scratch. Uh-oh, guess I spoke too soon. Some puppy's in need of a manicure. Come on, she won't even ask for a tip. What can we do? Yeah. Hmm. Wait, that's it! Cling film! Just roll it out and wrap it around your hat. Hmm. Now smear on some of Puppy's favorite food. With Puppy's little treat, we can pull off a little trick. Puppy's good as new. Just be careful where you step. You'll need some footwear. Any ideas? Hmm, 
clown shoes have room to spare. Well, maybe he'll grow into them? <laughs> Silly Pomni, that's no place for a balloon. <laughs> hey, pop it! It can be Puppy's new booties. We can even mix and match the colors. <laughs> Ugh, that ear pimple is huge. We better lance it. A spider! Let's send it back to its web. Aw, we'd never let anything harm you. Like him! You can take the dog out of the box, but not the box out of the dog. Do you think Kane's on to us? Silly Kane, there's no puppies hiding here. See? There's nothing in the box. Seriously. Where, oh, where has my little dog gone? Oh, there he is. We were so worried. What you could use is a disguise. Oh, that unicorn's giving me an idea. Let's start by borrowing that party hat. Now we'll need some colorful slime. It can add a splash of color to the hat. Just let gravity do the work for you. Make two. One for each floppy ear. Add some ribbon for that final touch. Want to give us a little thank you gift? Ew, you really shouldn't have. Still, why don't you make a paw print? Now add some glitter and glue. Give it time to dry and add it as a pendant. <laughs> Puppy could use a costume too. But it needs to be puppy shaped. What we need is some tule and lots of it. We'll need a bunch. Twist them up in a row. Pretty soon, our pup will have a brand new tutu. You're the circus's newest attraction. Oh no! Looks like Kane's on our trail. This potty break's a real emergency. Phew, it worked. But where's Puppy? There he is, and he's got a mop head. Silly Puppy, we need that for mopping. Clowns land on their feet, right? You know, this could make a nice wig. <laughs> Inspiration strikes. Grab an old sock. Now fill it up with some stuffing. <laughs> fill up those holes with a familiar face. <laughs> it's Ragatha. Don't forget the bow. Now Puppy's got a new friend. He's about to put the rag in Ragdoll. Hey, why don't we play some fetch? Tired already? You could use a place to rest. Grab that toilet seat and cover it up with stockings. Now break up an old plastic bottle. We can use it to make some teeth. Now for some eyes. Just add water. Add something soft. 
It's the best seat in the house. It's unusual, but isn't it cozy? Huh? What's that, boy? You want your own potty? And that's not all. He needs it in a hurry. What can we use? Hey, the flower pot. Start by dumping out all the soil. Hey, what you eating, Mr. Pigeon? Seeds! That's just what we need. Now add water. Not too much now. And that's how our garden grows. Of course, fire hydrants are traditional. Plus, it's our old pal, Kinger. Guess it's time for a little business. Aw, oh, now Puppy's feeling hungry. Well, we could share some chips. Nah, that's not exactly puppy food. Let's cover the tube with tape. Add a hole and some decorations. Fill it up with treats and seal it up. Here, puppy, try to collect the treats. Sometimes you can play with your food. Hey, it's a roll of blue toilet paper. You know, TP can be a lot of fun. Especially when your house needs some streamers. Pretty soon, a house becomes a circus tent. Don't forget the flag on top. Admissions free. Puppy's the star of the show. But even big stars can get lonely. We've got the cure for boredom. You need something you can play with. Grab an old rubber glove. Fill it with water. Seal it up and make some twists. Add eyes and a mouth, and it's our old pal Jax. <laughs> Puppy's looking pretty popular with all those friends. They're always happy to just hang around. But not everyone's happy to see Pomni. Think the disguise will fool Kane? Well, so far the hats are working. And that tutu's the perfect disguise. Especially when paired with cute little booties. <laughs> we did it! We hid Puppy in plain sight. Yeah, Pomni's got to stick together. Time for dinner. Now how did he get in here? Now that's much better. Let's dig in. Could use some gravy. Hmm, what's that smell? Dogs really need to try out the whole litter box idea. Well, this pooper scooper looks like it makes things easy. Good job. Probably should sanitize the couch. Still, it looks like we got this scooper just in time. Just how many dogs do you have again? Look at all that rain. Oh no, that poor puppy. We have to save him, hurry. First things first, let's get you an umbrella. Well, that was easy. Now it's time to get out of this rain. Or go to the park? Well, gotta get in those steps. Good thing there's room enough for two. 
Uh-oh. And this is why you need to puppy-proof. Either way, you need a bath. Uh, better yet, a shower. Just plug it in, and you get a spritz and a scratch all in one. This puppy will be clean in no time. Every dog's gonna love the sound of that. Come on, a walk? It's such a great day for napping. Well, if we have to go, this cat will show you how to do it. First, let's try this charming cat carrier. Now this is a walk, the kind where you don't actually walk. Always love a nice ride through the country. Rain again? <laughs> Weather's sure weird around here. On the plus side, you don't need a shower tonight. Let's dry you off before things get even wetter. We just need to put you in this snazzy new outfit. Add a blow dryer to the tail and let the drying commence. Now you and your dog can get your hair done together. You should be done by now. Nice and dry. Wow, a retractable lollipop holder. Wonder what the retracting expert thinks. Well, one man's candy is a cat's face scratcher. Uh-oh, look at all those dirty paws. We'll need to start cleaning at the source. This device should help. Just add soap. Just squeeze out the foam and treat those paws. Don't forget to dry when you're done. And clean that couch. Speaking of paws, it's time for a manicure. Time to use your head. Seriously, wrap it up. And cover it up with some wet pet food? Someone isn't gonna mind cleaning it up. Good, a distraction. Now fix those nails. Don't worry, your dog won't feel betrayed. Especially when they learn there's food left over. This kitty's ready for a close-up, Mr. DeMille. If only cats could have fun costumes to wear. Who said they don't? Just look at this little cap. Release your inner beast. Or maybe get ready for the holidays. Say cheese. I mean, you are wearing mouse ears. And everyone can give your pupper a nice foot rub. Of course, pets need to stay hydrated when you carry them around. And with a few little twists and turns, it becomes a fountain. Maybe we can do the same by cutting it up. Like all our best crafts, it's time to add some fire. Stick in a bottle of water. Loosen the cap and let gravity do its job. Either way, the dogs like it. Scratching posts. Because, like the best of us, cats just know the importance of getting your nails done. Well, it's a good shape, but will it be good for scratching? This yarn should help. After all, 
It is yarn. And cats kind of have a thing for yarn. Aww. Let's just hot glue everything into place. And add a mustache. You know, just to keep things fancy. Good. Those nails are getting quite a workout. With googly eyes and a hat, it's a pretty good deal. But grooming isn't entirely your pet's responsibility. Hmm. These bristles will help clean up your cat's coat. Just in time, too. Ew. With all that hair, we can make a new cat. Yuck. Told ya. Well, yeah. we've got the glove, but what about those bristles? Ah, yes, hot glue. Just remember to let it dry. Well, the cat liked it, but it didn't really do anything. The toy cat can keep this. Now your cat can spend hours trying to catch fish. Though so after teasing him like this, you owe him a nice tuna dinner. Let's see if we can make our own version of this. Besides just letting your cat near a fish tank. Of course, adding catnip sure helps. And now you've got a kitty original to hang on the wall. What a deal! Well, when it comes to your cat's litter box, it's usually for the best to splurge. Cats need their privacy after all. I wonder if they synchronize this in advance. Probably should talk to your vet about this. Ew. Yeah, let's not waste a perfectly good sock. Here's a better idea. Let's make our own private litter box. Cool. Just need to make a door in this shelf. And add litter to the bottom. Now a cat can walk in whenever they need to. Though seriously, I'd really ask your vet about your cat and produce. As always, our animal actors were real professionals. Though the human one really could have learned a thing or two from them. Animal amazing stuff, right? Catch you next time. Litter boxes seem cleaner, but you still need to clean them. We're gonna need a tool for this. Just don't forget a bag. It'll come in handy. Just scoop things up. Probably should ask the vet about that. Maybe the cat's just hiding its veggies in here. Cool. See, I told you that bag would come in handy. Good thing, too. This box won't stay clean for long. Oh, that reminds us. It's time to exercise. Let's get ready. Get the leash, tie those laces, and head out. Really working up a sweat.
Come on, no pain, no gain. Oh, it's time for a break. It's important to hydrate. And I meant that for the both of you. Hmm. Luckily, we've got portable doggy bowls. Granted, bowls are usually portable, but not like this. Don't forget the kibble. Your furry friend totally earned it. Good, all gone. Now you can wrap it up. By the looks of it, somebody wants a muffin. Oh. And they're not going down without a fight. If only we could make a muffin tin treat for pups. Well, just fill each hole with kibble and a toy. Ah, tennis balls. You can never go wrong with tennis balls. Some prefer muffin tops, but this dog can't wait to get to the bottom. Now you're free to dig into those backup muffins. Ugh, where's the light switch? Careful not to trip. Don't worry, your pupper is here to help with a shiny new collar. You can customize the size and add as many as you need. And now your dog's ready for the next rave. Turn off the light, and why not join in on the fun too? Sorry, Cup, but the cat says you gotta go. Actually, pushing things off tables looks like fun. And these cat paws let you join in on the fun. Let's play with some cat toys while we're at it. The best part, use them to play with your cat. Yeah, that's the spot. Oh no, what cat doesn't come when the treats are shaking? Oh, the toilet, of course. The best seat in the house. Reunited. And it feels uh, suffocating, apparently. Let's use this hanger to help. Cut it up. We'll need to do a little bit of bending. Add a little tape to secure these arches in place. Place on a cardboard base. Just poke through. Cover it up so that it's a little tent. Your cat will never want to leave. And look who's up for a game of catch the finger. Looks like you're about to get a wet one. Don't make that a messy one. What have you been feeding this dog? We need to do something about this canine's teeth. Luckily, we've got a special doggy toothbrush. Looks like your cat's not the only one to get hairballs. Well, if you really need to lick your cat, this should help. Your cat gets a good brushing and no saliva. Clean up's a breeze. Why not groom yourself while you're at it? Hard to get up when you're moonlighting as a chair. But you can't just ghost your own mother. Here's what to do. Grab a pillow and remove the stuffing. Fill up a pair of old jeans you can afford to lose. Keep the legs crossed together. And now, it's time to make the old switcheroo. While we're at it, why not make a whole fake person? Now call your mother. Sensational stuff! Catch you next time. Aw, poor little rich girl. Oh no, what's gonna happen to all her pets? I mean, think of the hamster.
All these bristles should make paw cleaning a breeze. And look, it's electric. Just press the button and add water. Ugh. Just in time, too. Look at those dirty paws. It's like a before and after. Let's fix that. Much better. Wow. But let's try out the homemade version. It's a cup, but what'll we do for bristles? Good idea. Don't forget to add water. And by the looks of it, you'll need to power it yourself. It looks like it works just as well. You'll save quite a bit if you put in some elbow grease. Yes, it's playtime. Bring on the toys. It's like a carrot patch with hidden treasure. Never underestimate a puppy's sense of smell. I sense a pattern. Oh, look under the carrots. Now let's see if we can make our own fun. If you ever wanted to play tic-tac-toe with animals, now you know how. Wait, do you have to eat the treats too? And it looks like we have a winner. And he's such a good sport. Finally, something for the hamsters. Wow, this is like the easiest maze ever. Aww. You win, and the prize is hamster snacks. Maybe we can have some fun with this tube too. Ew. Soon we'll have our own little labyrinth. And we can add extensions too. Just keep on eating chips. Speaking of snacks, either way, he's happy with the end result. Next up is a little something special for the cat. This combines the fun of an avocado with the things cats go nuts for, catnip. This kitty's gonna sleep well tonight. Now, what can we do with this toilet paper roll? First, cut it up into four pieces. Fold them together into a sphere and add a treat inside. And once again, the game begins. Oh, it's not free, it's priceless. Which one will she choose? I would have picked the one for the hamster. Just think of all the leg room. Being carried around, it's the only way to travel. Now it's time to try this giant tote bag. Yes, never underestimate the power of leg room. Just don't make the holes too big, or Aww. she'll escape. Oh, trash day again. Whoa. Seems like we did this last week. Uh-oh, okay. the raccoons are back. Oh, wait, that's no raccoon. 
Oh, what a cute little puppy. And look, no collar. Good thing you already got this pet backpack on you. Aquariums. They're not just for fish anymore. Huh, there's not a lot of leg room, is there? With a backpack like that, he's ready to go into space. Right out of the case, and he's already got muddy paws. Oh, right, you found him in the trash. Well, a nice warm bath should perk things up. Or don't dogs lick themselves clean? No, wait, that's cats. How cute, a dog brush. And it even has a little place to hold your soap. Rub-a-dub-dub. This must be a dog's favorite type of bath. The kind that doesn't use any water. But it works. Mm-hmm. Good thing. Otherwise, he'd be shaking the water off. And we wouldn't get this tender moment. Wow, he must be clean to be on the furniture clean. And now he gets his own wardrobe, too. Huh, a little big, but maybe he'll grow into it. Oh, wow, look at those nails. We need a manicure, hmm. stat. Sure, I've seen green nails before, but that was just paint. Why stop at the nails? Let's take care of that fur, too. Mm-hmm. Of course, the most important part of a beauty routine, canine or otherwise, is keeping clean. Cue the foam. Still, no true day of pampering is ever complete without some form of facial mask. Ooh. Hmm, what else can we do for our day of indulgence? Oh, good idea, some brushing. With a tongue? I repeat, isn't licking yourself clean more of a cat thing, not a dog thing, or a people thing? At least it seems easy to clean. Ah, now for a massage. Oh, and look, we've got a gadget for that too. First a nice neck rub, and then just work your way down the back. Hmm, does it work on people? Well, I guess you can after all. Though you should probably ask before using it. Mm -hmm. Time for dinner. Good, because I haven't eaten in like a whole hour. Mmm, a nice <laughs> salad. And the puppy gets... Mm, yeah. Just some kibble. And even he doesn't look yeah. too appetized. Maybe hmm. it's all in the presentation. Ooh. Let's cut along the lines. It's just like coloring. And we want some bend to it, so add some tape. Now everything's got a nice shape. But still, we don't want to show off something that looks like cardboard. Gold-colored paint covers hmm. all sins. Ooh. And so do a bunch of fake jewels. Just don't advertise the fake bit. Man, and all this just to host the dog food bowl. Speaking of which, can we jazz up the food here too? Great! Good boy, look at him eating. All gone. Guess it's true what they say. You reap what you sow. Wow. I wonder if that dog knows the goose that laid the golden egg. Anyone think they're related? Well, into the drawer. Oh, what's this? Oh, this hmm. looks like a collar. Huh? Just what our four-legged friend needs. But it needs something extra. Rhinestones are nice and all, but we want something personalized. And a photo will help show ownership. Well, oh, looks like he's on a roll. Literally. He's going to look so handsome with his new collar. Which means that it's the perfect time for a selfie. Give us a smile. Show us some teeth, but not in a show of dominance sort of way. Any other photo ideas? Let's make a fun border. Now pick a theme. Ah yes, the source of all happiness, money. Just don't use the real kind. 
Though by the looks of things, this new owner can probably afford to. Oh, he'll look so handsome in his portrait. Surrounded by Ooh. money. Just like Scrooge McDuck. Oh. After all this hmm. pampering, it's finally time for our puppy to relax. You better be planning a game of fetch taking hmm. his ball like that. Oh, wow, hmm. a golden bone! Let's hope it's not real. I mean, you could chip a tooth. Hmm, seems like enough fun for today. It's time to get ready for bed. Or instead. Aw, what a cute little wiener pup. And they blow up so fast, don't they? Still, this pupper could use some fur. Now she's a real dog. Thank you, Blue Fairy. And she's got a surprise. More puppies are on the way. Good thing she went to vet school. Cause it's time for a sonogram. Oh, look, someone's having triplets. Which means you're eating for four now. Well, that just proves my point. Good thing we've got our handy dandy pooper scooper. Just look at that face. He's so happy to help. Oh, me so full. But me could always eat one more. Puppy owners need to keep up their strength, too. And if she can get a treat, too, she won't complain. Though you're kind of getting a little messy. Don't worry. This hula hoop will help. Of course, a little water's just common sense. Let's dry you off. And just in time for a little costume change. Sometimes you just need a random dance break. But we could do without all this hair. Some durian fruit should help. Slice in half. And add some hot glue. And stick to the wall. Now it's a makeshift scratching post. One that will keep all that hair in one place. Of course, we want puppies to have a little fur. Oh no! And you didn't even overwater it! It's simple. Our pup needs a secret garden all her own. Ooh, let's add treats our dog will appreciate. Eh, maybe make sure they get in the hole. Come on, girl. It's time to look for buried treasure. And maybe you should try trimming that. Uh-oh, someone got into some paint. Still, these are some nice paw prints. Cut them out and shrink them in the oven. Now that's what I call puppy-sized. And they're your collar's crowning glory. Are the sheep visiting? Wait, no, someone's teething. Don't worry, we'll give you something to chew on. Stuff up some tights. And we mean plural. Now staple them up together. Well, this should give us a hand. You know, there's always time for a manicure. And now, you've got the best seat in the house. Hot dog. That is one big sausage. You know, bread's not the only thing that can be a soup bowl. Besides, 
She likes her ramen to have extra meat. And there's plenty to go around. Okay, we really need to start cleaning under here more often. Or at least keep better track of our tennis balls. With a little needling, keep them on a string. <laughs> In fact, this works for all sorts of things. Hang them up. It's like a party in a cube. Of course, all good parties need snacks. Now for the big unveiling. It's like a puppy playroom. The piece de resistance. The tennis ball. Oh, she's going to sleep good tonight. Silly puppy, that's for drinking. Uh, sort of. Good thing it comes in fun size. Press the button and fill her up. Have a drink. And when you're done, how about some TP? Oh, poor puppy. All alone on a hot day like today. We've got to help. Naturally, we'll start with a makeover. Ew. If only fleas were this easy to get rid of. Two eyes are plenty. Look at all these bugs. Next time, you should really wear gloves. Oh, don't worry. We're almost finished here. Of course, our new friend here could still use a wash. Maybe this hula hoop is just what we need. Take out your soldering iron. Never leave home without it. And make a few holes, especially a big one. Now, garçon, just what we need. A hose. Secure it in place and turn on the water. We've made our own little dog wash. She doesn't even need to move. We can just run her through it. Well, it helps if she moves her paws. Yeah, that's a good girl. A rinse is a good start, but soap's important too. Just add it to this new gadget. Brush away. Just don't forget to rinse off. Good thing we're already doing this outside. <laughs> All done. Now let's dry her off. Uh-oh. It looks like we missed a spot. Quick, let's put this device together. It's a paw cleaner. Once again, we'll need water. <laughs> it's best to do this one paw at a time. What a good girl, letting us clean her paws. Hmm, the rest of the paw looks nice, but look at those nails. This is a Manny Petty emergency. But we'll need something special. Let's cut up this bag. It's going to be a harness for our dog. <laughs> Hang it up. Dog included. This might take some muscle. Now she'll stay in one place as we file down those pesky nails. Though something tells me she doesn't mind a little beauty treatment. Much better. Now let's go home. <laughs> Mi casa es su casa. Hey, that doesn't mean the floor is your personal toilet. Well, this mess won't clean itself up. Time for the advanced pooper scooper. Complete with bags. Just open it up and wrap around the mouth of the device. <laughs> wow. 
Now you can pick everything up without getting your hands dirty. Ew. Just remember, you might need more than one bag. Uh-oh, she's shedding? Uh, is she a dog or a cat? Seriously, I'd say there's enough fur for a whole new dog. But it looks like our furry friend beat me to it. Well, it's nothing a little vacuuming can't fix. Ew. We'll need to keep all this fur under control. And this new brush should help. It collects the hair all up in one big clump. <laughs> and clean up a breeze. The hair just falls off. <laughs> uh, looks like you missed a few spots. This should help. It attracts all this hair like a magnet. And the cover takes it all off for you. Phew. Unfortunately, we're just getting started with the cleanup. Oh, wow. good. With all this work, we huh? earned a treat. Hmm. Yeah, I had to say treat. Hmm? Good thing we've already got this big bag of dog food. Do you take your kibble dry or wet? <laughs> well, at least we know she likes it. In fact, something tells me she wants seconds. This device should help. Just fill it up with kibble. And all it takes to get more is just pushing a button. Round and round it goes. <laughs> now she can have seconds and thirds, and possibly fourths. And we can enjoy our pizza. Oh, poor little rich girl. Oh no, what's gonna happen to all her pets? I mean, think of the hamster. All these bristles should make paw cleaning a breeze. And look, it's electric. Just press the button and add water. Just in time, too. Look at those dirty paws. It's like a before and after. Let's fix that. Much wow. better. But let's try out the homemade version. Ew. It's a cup, but what do we do for bristles? Good idea. Don't forget to add water. And by the looks of it, you'll need to power it yourself. It looks like it works just as well. You'll save quite a bit if you put in some elbow grease. Yes, it's playtime. Bring on the toys. It's like a carrot patch with hidden treasure. Never underestimate a puppy's sense of smell. I sense a pattern. Oh, look under the carrots. Now let's see if we can make our own fun. If you ever wanted to play tic-tac-toe with animals, now you know how. Wait, do you have to eat the treats too? And it looks like we have a winner. And he's such a good sport. Finally, something for the hamsters. Wow, this is like the easiest maze ever. You win, and the prize is hamster snacks. 
Maybe we can have some fun with this tube too. Ew. Soon we'll have our own little labyrinth. And we can add extensions too. Just keep on eating chips. Speaking of snacks, either way, he's happy with the end result. Hmm, anyone getting deja vu watching this? Oh, so touching! Hey, can I have one of those tissues? Oh no! Not the television! Did we lose power? Naughty puppy! You could have hurt yourself! Huh. We're gonna need to puppy-proof the house. This pop tube could help. Just slit it open. Just slip them over these wires so they're nice and safe. Great, the television is back on and we can watch together. Still, it's nice to have some private time. I guess someone didn't get the memo. Oh, she's not going anywhere. Meals always taste better with company. And without utensils? And it's great to always have someone watching over you. Oh, you're not getting out of this. We'll need to get creative. With this water balloon rubber glove, she'll always have a tender touch. <laughs> Relaxation can be found right in the palm of your mm, glove. <laughs> Checkmate, or king me. Either way, she needs some stimulation. <laughs> this mat should help. Just hide some treats under the flaps. And just look, there's a whole bunch of different Ooh. hiding places. We can even hide some right out in the open. Oh, she's good at finding all these hidden treasures. She'd make a great detective, or maybe a pirate. <laughs> Someone deserves a thank you. A nice, big, wet, sloppy thank you. <gasps> Hmm, her tongue needs a little distraction. Add peanut butter to this mat. She gets peanut butter and your face stays dry. Everyone wins. <laughs> now it's time for some fun in the sun. Hmm? Uh -huh. Come on, you need to get out too. And we've got the perfect suit for you to wear. You'll look so pretty with all these bows. And you can't forget to accessorize. Of course, it's also important to stay hydrated. And that goes for the both of you. This bottle should help. We just need to make a few strategic cuts. Once again, our handy soldering iron comes to the rescue. Make sure that hole is nice and big. And add another filled bottle through it. Twist the lid and it dispenses the water for you. Now it's time for us to relax. Uh-oh, the paparazzi are out on the prowl. Careful, I think they can see by motion. Oh no! Let's get out of here! Do you hear something? Oh. oh, that little girl's crying and holding a poster. I think we can all figure out where this is going. Okay, they look alike, but I think we should spring for DNA testing. 
<laughs> well, at least she's cheered up. Wonderful. What a happy ending. A cat. Hope she likes peanut butter. Petsational stuff. Catch you next time. Cats might want a drink. So, let's give them their own fountain. After all, it's easy to get hot when you can't take off your fur coat. Always smart to try things out before trying on the cats. Now that they have water, they might want something to nibble on too. And we're going all natural with cat grass. And there's plenty of room for a bowl full of cat chow. But let's keep the fridge stocked with wet food, just in case. Everything's really coming together. Let's add some more toys. Well, he's off to Wonderland. What's down there anyway? Ooh, candy. Oh, this bowl should fill up the hole. It's the perfect place for some cat toys. And if the cats are feeling a bit hungry at playtime, this toy's the perfect thing. Just add food. See, they'll get a treat when they spin it around. That'll keep them active. <laughs> hey, can we borrow this pillow? Now take some tights and cut them up. We need an X shape with some material in the middle. Tie each of the two opposite ends together. It's like a bed and swing all in one. Let's test it out. You know, these buttons can help get their point across. They can tell us when they want water, food, or even playtime. It's a bit too small to be a staircase. But we can still use the base. Attach to the wall, and we've got stairs after all. Hey, you're not using this giant bucket, are you? Thanks! Now that we've cleaned it out, we'll cut out an opening. Huh, what else do we need? How about more toys? You can never have enough cat toys. And we can use them for a project. Hot glue them to the patch from earlier. You remember from the hole? Add them to the bottom of our can for a soft cushion. Now break out the power tools. We're drilling some holes. After making a few, run some thread through them. It's kind of like a checkerboard pattern. The cats are gonna be so happy. Where are they anyway? I uh, think you've got a little something there. Oh, that gives me an idea. Add hot glue, press it down, and it's as good as laminated. Perfect for keychains or personalized collars. This cat toy's interactive. Let's add it to our collection. Cats sure have good taste. This looks fun. Time for another craft. Hmm, with this mold, we can make a bunch of little jewels of different sizes and colors. Put them all together and we can make a fun mobile, like for a baby crib. Just hang it up and he's fast asleep. Wow, I thought he would need a bedtime story or two. Let's cut back to daytime. Time for a fun dress up. Ooh. And don't worry, just because dogs don't normally wear clothes doesn't mean they can't accessorize. <laughs> mm. Ah, adorable. Huh, he doesn't really seem to be a hat dog. Got anything else he'd like? How about hoodies? 
Well, the light up buttons have spoken. No, oh, but red is certainly his color. And it looks like he agrees. Just add some chains and some sunglasses, and he'll make Snoop Dogg look like Snoop Cat. Ooh. Let's see what other outfits he'd like to try. A white tuxedo? Does he look like James Bond? Hmm, maybe another color will do. Oh, he seems to prefer the more <laughs> classic black look. And it certainly seems to suit him. Oh, he's just so cute. What big eyes he's got. Time for another day of fun with your furry <laughs> friend. <laughs> what can be better than a puppy? Simple, more than hmm. one puppy. Ooh. And this one's so big, you just want to cuddle him up. And soon, there'll be even more puppies. In the meantime, our blushing bride wants some kibble. And maybe a steak or two. That was bow wow-tastic! Yeah, I went there. Catch you next time! A watermelon! Let's slice it up! Well, that's one way to do it. Still, we'll need a few more cuts. Now it's time to scoop out the good stuff. But first, we're gonna need the rind. With some eyes and ears, it's a puppy! As for the red stuff, let's get out the cookie cutter and make some fun shapes. With all these animals, it's our very own zoo. Now, one for me, one for you. It's selfie time. Well, that's not going on the fridge. Don't worry, all you need is some handy-dandy cardboard. Time to put those art classes to work. All that green can only mean one thing. It's a dinosaur! Well, almost. <laughs> we still need a head. And we've got just the right one. Perfect. You can be anything. The limit's your imagination. Sometimes puppies need help communicating. But all you need are just a few buttons. <laughs> now your dog can let you know what it needs. Whether it's playtime. Or just a drink. Or even a little pampering. After all, it's hard work being this cute all the time. Now it's time for a massage. Or, as she calls it, a belly rub. Well, I guess your photo needs a new frame. Better yet, let's get a document folder. Now you can finally give your photos an outline. Like you're in your very own cartoon. Huh, that's an idea. We'll just need a projector. Tape it on. Add some light. And enjoy the show. This is just what the wall needs. Go grab some paint. And put those tracing skills to work. A pacifier? Oh, that gives me an idea. Hmm. It just needs another cut. And we can add a Scooby snack inside. Let's add a decoration while we're at it. Oh, 
Aw, now she's giving us a smile. <laughs> Is anyone else feeling dizzy? Oh, it's laundry day. Hmm, I guess those jeans were dry clean only. Well, at least we know someone they'll fit. Something tells me this happens a lot on laundry day. Well, now they're mm -hmm. two of a kind. <laughs> you know, you should really take turns. Don't forget, she's got an audition for a kibble commercial in an hour. So, when can we expect the puppies? Bow wow-tastic stuff. Catch you next time. Oh, poor puppy. All alone on a hot day like today. We've got to help. Naturally, we'll start with a makeover. Ew. If only fleas were this easy to get rid of. Two eyes are plenty. Look at all these bugs. Next time, you should really wear gloves. Oh, don't worry. We're almost finished here. Of course, our new friend here could still use a wash. Maybe this hula hoop is just what we need. Take out your soldering iron. Never leave home without it. And make a few holes, especially a big one. Now, garçon, just what we need. A hose. Secure it in place and turn on the water. We've made our own little dog wash. She doesn't even need to move. We can just run her through it. Well, it helps if she moves her paws. Yeah, that's a good girl. A rinse is a good start, but soap's important too. Just add it to this new gadget. Brush away. Just don't forget to rinse off. Good thing we're already doing this outside. <laughs> All done. Now let's dry her off. Uh-oh. It looks like we missed a spot. Quick, let's put this device together. It's a paw cleaner. Once again, we'll need water. <laughs> it's best to do this one paw at a time. What a good girl, letting us clean her paws. Hmm, the rest of the paw looks nice, but look at those nails. Instant cats, just add water. <laughs> and they say cats don't like water. Let's just sneak on by. Aww. Nothing to see. Home free. Oh, coochie coo. <laughs> this is gonna be a great day. Oh, I jinxed it. Hmm. This bed could use a makeover anyway. Remove this wood. Add a panel to the side. Oh, anyone getting dizzy? A fresh coat of paint fixes up everything. All three walls. Let's see what we can do for the outside. A stencil pattern. Let's spread on some paint. Who says we need a brush? Besides, this is much faster. Peel off. On second thought, a brush can take care of the little details. Look, a cat face. As if you didn't guess who this was for. Hmm, this hole looks scratchy. And not the kind cats like. This cat door will help make an easy entrance. And with the help of these toothbrushes, the cats will get the scratches they like. Let's take a quick tour, shall we? This grass carpet will please the wild cat inside your pet. What else can we add? Hmm, an old pizza box? 
Cover with tape and you can make a few steps. Steps right to the cat's own private bathroom. Meet the new and improved litter box. Now, what else do cats like? How about this? Take some rope and twist it around a base. Tie it so it's nice and tight. And your cat has a new scratching post. What else? Maybe they'll like that pigeon. Oh, even better. Take a desk drawer, add pillows, cushions and some toys, and it's a brand new bed. Here's something we can add to the wall. Now your cats have their own private television. Oh, it's getting hot in here. You know, the... Next up is a little something special for the cat. Wow! This combines the fun of an avocado with the things cats go nuts for. Catnip. This kitty's gonna sleep well tonight. Now, what can we do with this toilet paper roll? First, cut it up into four pieces. Fold them together into a sphere and add a treat inside. And once again, the game begins. Oh, it's not free, it's priceless. Which one will she choose? I would have picked the one for the hamster. Just think of all the leg room. Being carried around, it's the only way to travel. Now it's time to try this giant mm. tote bag. Yes, never underestimate the power of legroom. Just don't make the holes too big or Aww. she'll escape. Everyone can give your pupper a nice foot rub. Of course, pets need to stay hydrated when you carry them around. And with a few little twists and turns, it becomes a fountain. Maybe we can do the same by cutting it up. Like all our best crafts, it's time to add some fire. Stick in a bottle of water. Loosen the cap and let gravity do its job. Either way, the dogs like it. Scratching posts, because, like the best of us, cats just know the importance of getting your nails done. Hello. Well, it's a good shape, but will it be good for scratching? This yarn should help. After all, it is yarn, and cats kind of have a thing for yarn. Let's just hot glue everything into place. And add a mustache. You know, just to keep things fancy. Good, those nails are getting quite a workout. With googly eyes and a hat, it's a pretty good deal. This is a mani-pedi emergency! But we'll need something special. Let's cut up this bag. 
It's gonna be a harness for our dog. <laughs> Hang it up. Dog included. This might take some muscle. Now she'll stay in one place as we file down those pesky nails. Though something tells me she doesn't mind a little beauty treatment. Much better. Now let's go home. Mi casa es su casa. Hey, that doesn't mean the floor is your personal toilet. Well, this mess won't clean itself up. Time for the advanced pooper scooper, complete with bags. Just open it up and wrap around the mouth of the device. Now you can pick everything up without getting your hands dirty. Just remember you might need more than one bag. Uh-oh, she's shedding? Uh, is she a dog or a cat? Seriously, I'd say there's enough fur for a whole new dog. But it looks like our furry friend beat me to it. Well, it's nothing a little vacuuming can't fix. Ew. We'll need to keep all this fur under control. And this new brush should help. It collects the hair all up in one big clump. <laughs> and clean up a breeze. The hair just falls off. <laughs> uh, looks like you missed a few spots. This should help. It attracts all this hair like a magnet. And the cover takes it all off for you. Phew. Unfortunately, we're just getting started with the cleanup. Oh, oh good. Wow. With all this work, we uh -huh. earned a treat. Hmm. Yeah, I had to say treat. Hmm? Good thing we've already got this big bag of dog food. Do you take your kibble dry or wet? <laughs> well, at least we know she likes it. In fact, something tells me she wants seconds. This device should help. Just fill it up with kibble. And all it takes to get more is just pushing a button. Round and round it goes. <laughs> Now she can have seconds, and thirds, and possibly fourths. And we can enjoy our pizza. Hmm, anyone getting deja vu watching this? Oh, so touching. Hey, can I have one of those tissues? Oh no, not the television. Did we lose power? Naughty puppy, you could have hurt yourself. Huh. We're gonna need to puppy-proof the house. This pop tube could help. Just slit it open. Just slip them over these wires so they're nice and safe. Great, the television is back on and we can watch together. Still, it's nice to have some private time. I guess someone didn't get the memo. Oh, she's not going anywhere. Meals always taste better with company. And without utensils. And it's great to always have someone watching over you. Oh, you're not getting out of this. We'll need to get creative. With this water balloon rubber glove, she'll always have a tender touch. <laughs> Relaxation can be found right in the palm of your mm, glove. <laughs> Checkmate, or king me. Either way, she needs some stimulation. <laughs> this mat should help. Just hide some treats under the flaps. 
And just look, there's a whole bunch of different Ooh. hiding places. We can even hide some right out in the open. Oh, she's good at finding all these hidden treasures. She'd make a great detective. Or maybe a pirate. <laughs> Someone deserves a thank you. A nice, big, wet, sloppy thank you. Hmm, her tongue needs a little distraction. Add peanut butter to this mat. She gets peanut butter, and your face stays dry. Everyone wins. Now it's time for some fun in the sun. Come on, you need to get out too. And we've got the perfect suit for you to wear. You'll look so pretty with all these bows. And you can't forget to accessorize. Of course, it's also important to stay hydrated. And that goes for the both of you. This bottle should help. We just need to make a few strategic cuts. Once again, our handy soldering iron comes to the rescue. Make sure that hole is nice and big. And add another filled bottle through it. Twist the lid and it dispenses the water for you. Now it's time for us to relax. Uh-oh, the paparazzi are out on the prowl. Careful, I think they can see by motion. Let's get out of here. Do you hear something? Oh, that little girl's crying and holding a poster. I think we can all figure out where this is going. Okay, they look alike. But I think we should spring for DNA testing. <laughs> well, at least she's cheered up. Wonderful. What a happy ending. A cat. Hope she likes peanut butter. Petsational stuff. Catch you next time. Cat food? Maybe we should leave some things to the cats. Oh, it's just a toy. And we've got the perfect place for it. You know, it's a little small. We need to think bigger. Let's get a large glass container filled with water. Fill with stones and marbles. Add a plant. And the finishing touch, these cute little fish. I spy with my little eye, well, her eye, eyes, a plastic bottle. Empty it and cut it up. Take the bottom and hot glue some string in the middle. Now use the string to reattach the two pieces. Add a pom-pom to the top and fill with cat chow. Hang it up. More snacks? These are gonna be some lucky cats. Cool, a laser for our cats to catch. Let's try it out. Either it's the laser or she needs to clean her pores. Hard to catch, just what we need. What's on your head? It's like a fidget spinner. Let's add to the wall. What can't be improved with the addition of stickers? These pictures will help give it a more homey feel. Some more toys. Cats sure know how to live. Maybe we can put this tablecloth to better use as the curtains for our brand new cat hangout. Yeah, this is where all the cool cats come to play. Great place for a nap. 
You gotta for a big day of sleeping. Still, look at all the fun stuff to do. Eat grass. Use stuffed animals as a floor. Or just relax. Looks like someone's ready to play too. Or maybe just stretch. You gotta love all the accommodations. And there's still so much more to explore. Who needs steps when you have a giant scratching post to climb? Unwind, watch a little TV, have a drink. Oh no, he's found the cats. I mean, what cats? Oh, it's love at first sight. Meow, horrific stuff. Catch you next time. Hey, has anyone seen Pomni today? Wow, she's a real hide and seek champion. Well, she can hide, but let's hope she can run too. Don't worry, Pomni. Kitty's got an idea. Aw, they grow up so fast. Come on, Pomni. Let's go inside. Uh-oh. It's Kane's exclusive private club. It's time to put on a happy face. Got any extra masks? Huh, didn't think so. Well, all we need is a little makeover. Start with some lipstick. Nice and red. Lots and lots of red. We're talking sunburn. Now it's time we rethink your wardrobe. Come on, jesters went out with the 18th century. Next, your hair. Grab some strawberries and mash them up into, well, mush. Now massage this mix into your hair. Pretty soon, your hair will match your face. Next, let's head to the old water closet. Cause next, we'll need a toilet seat. Now add some pink foam clay to make a nice rim. Of course, our new gums will need some new teeth. And some painted plastic bottles will do the trick. Plus some old tubes for incisors. Next, why don't we blow up a balloon? <laughs> and cover it up with TP. Now pour on some glue and spread it out. Once it dries, it's time to pop the balloon. But it's not done yet. Cut it up and make some even tinier balloons. They're great for adding some dots. Which is just what we need for some new eyes. Next, let's try on some new shoes. Hmm, kind of snug, aren't they? Brings new meaning to open toe shoes. I know. Let's make a mold of some teeth. All we need now is a model. Splendid. Once it's in shape, add some white glue. And cover it up with some pink too. Now just add a few familiar features. And your new shoe covers are two of a kind. 
Hey, you almost done mopping the floor? Cause we're gonna need that bucket. Cover the rim with a pool noodle. Flip it over. Note the hat-like shape. Still, it could use a fresh coat of black paint. Soon, Kane will have his trademark hat. Come on, why don't you try it on? Gesundheit. You need a tissue? And maybe you could use some pants. Quick, hide behind those curtains. Wait. Curtains. We could use them. Start cutting. Cut along the shape of your legs. Make another so we can staple them together. Of course, we want our pants to look nice. So I think it's time to add some glitter. After all, the ringmaster needs to sparkle. A dental kit? Kane sure likes to stay on brand. Ooh, let's take care of that cavity. Make like a gas station and fill her up. Should probably ditch that black tooth too. Even the tooth fairy won't want this. So let's use our special tooth mold to help whip you up a brand new one. Much better. But don't forget the extra tooth. Cover it with glue and glitter. Add a chain for a cool new necklace. <laughs> Wait, is that? Oh, it just isn't safe to be a Pomni. Don't worry, we can fix you up. All you need is a new paint job. You know, it's such a good idea. I think Kane is gonna try some new paint too. Double the Pomni, double the fun. Hey look, it's a free pot tube. It's just the thing to go with all of our other pop tubes. Which is great, cause we've got a lot of pop tubes. <laughs> but it still could use a little something. A little something right under your shoe. Foam clay. Add a face and roll it up. Now add to our cane. Snack time. Guess cane likes salty and sweet. But everything's getting stuck in your teeth. Roaches! And there's some nasty buildup, too. We're gonna need a supercharged toothbrush. Wow. Just wait until you see what we use for floss. You know, I think Kane's really coming together. It's the classic look, but with a few personal touches. But now let's see if we pass the test. Seems pretty cane, wouldn't you say? Come to think of it, a little too cane. Eh, it's always best to be yourself. Hey! Don't get caught red-handed. Or orange-pawed, as the case may be. And we can squeeze in a manicure. Now try on these stylish no-stick slippers. 
Gimme paw. Here, kitty. It's our dentist kit. And it's in need of a checkup. Seriously, though, what has this guy been eating? Much better. But now it's your turn. Hmm? Walnut shells? We'll put them to better use. Wow, brand new, and they still need a cleaning. I guess a dentist's job is never done. Kitty says it's time for a haircut. Ooh, a page boy cut? No, something with a little more bounce. Ooh, maybe you need a little more practice. Our friend here wants a whole new look. Start by giving him some luscious locks. Now give him a trim. Oh, guess you like the original. It's Pomni's turn now. I think she wants a flat look. But that's more than enough bangs. Let's show the world your clowny face. And who can say no to a little decorations? Look, kitty, a cupcake. Just needs frosting. Hold on, we're not done yet. Now put your paw in. Fill it with little hearts and letters. Add some glue, and it's a new pendant. Just the thing for a brand new necklace. She'd like her tip now, please. A plant? I think she was thinking tuna or something. Hey, look, there's a paper cap in here. I know, let's draw Pomni and color it in. Now cut it out and shrink it down to size. And Kitty gets a necklace of her own. Portrait time, don't blink, goes for both of you. I think your model wants a quick peek. Ooh, talk about a rough draft. I know, a mini photo printer's just what we need. Just pick a photo and print it out. In fact, you can start a whole album. <laughs> but Kitty's got another idea, a DIY printer. We just need to borrow a pencil or two. Now run a picture through it. Ooh, an x-ray. Or it's an all-in-one crayon box. Honestly, you can never guess what can happen. Time for bed. Hey, is someone there? Uh-oh, we've got company. Quick, the lights. Aha. What we need's a special nightlight. Look, our little duck can even change colors. I think Kitty likes them too. Whoops, it's okay. Just grab a balloon, a paper towel, and some glue. Think of it like a paper mache craft and make it a chinchilla while we're at it. Remove the balloon and add some light. Don't worry, he's got your back. Nighty night. Looks like Kitty wants to do some shopping. 
Did you spring for speedy delivery? Guess so. What you get? Ooh, a portable blender. Throw in some of your favorite foods. Add yogurt. And start blending away. Hey now, you've got your own blender. Let's try it out. Milk. Chocolate, already a winning combination. Now let's add in one whole donut. Well, most of it. It's our secret ingredient. Now let's blend it all together. Ooh, I think it's ready. But the real test's the taste. Want some cocoa with those marshmallows? Ugh, is that cat hair? Don't worry. Kitty will make it up to you with an ice cream float. And look, a cute little duck. But not for long. Meanwhile, Kitty likes a different kind of drink. First, stir up the milk until it's nice and frothy. And Kitty prefers food with a face. Just eat, a uh, drink around the eyes. Here, Kitty, it's time to take your medicine. But you gotta. Maybe your toy garden can help. Plant it like a seed and just see how your garden grows. Let's see if Kitty can find the hidden treasure. Now she'll take the pill with her treats. Good job! There's more where that came from. Well, there was. Okay. Kitty, grab your dispenser. Just put it together. And a treat's ready right at the push of a button. <laughs> Looks like Kitty's due for a shot. <laughs> Maybe it's time for a quick getaway. <laughs> Shh, Kitty. We need to be quiet. That's not the thanks I expected. Wait, Kitty's gonna be a new mommy. Wow. <laughs> Kitty's gonna need a new nursery. Let's empty this closet now and lay down some foam puzzle pieces. Aww. What's next? Oh, oh careful! Ouch. Oh, good thing Pomni <gasps> broke your fall. Well, it wasn't so good for her. Quick, Kitty, call her an ambulance. She's an ambulance. Ha uh ha. -huh. You're going to feel a little sleepy. Ooh, check out that back pimple. Let's clear out all that green stuff. But now, let's dig a little deeper. Hmm, Pomni's still a little flat, but a nice frame can work wonders. Hey, a toy car! And it's not stopping! Anyone catch that tiny license plate? Maybe this magic toilet can help. Hey, there's cat treats inside! And I think Kitty ordered delivery. Now let's rev up those engines. Hmm, guess it was a double order. Okay, next, grab a cardboard box. And add some cardboard shelves. Now we've got a Kitty cupboard. This'll keep out all those roaches. 
especially if we keep it safe and sound. This deserves a round of applause. Hmm, this pillow feels kind of rough. Oh, no wonder. It's full of rocks. I know. Let's grab an old pair of tights. And fill it up with some popcorn. Close it up and maybe cover it up. Now the kitties can have a great cat nap. Guess we've earned a little snack break. <laughs> hey! And here I thought cats liked milk. But we can still use that plastic bowl. We need to run some string through it. Add a pop tube rim. A pillow inside. And hang up your swinging new seat. You got a new fish. Ew. You know, with a few adjustments, a toy bed is the perfect fish tank. Plus a few accessories. And water. Water's important. And you know Kitty just loves fish. Uh -huh. Oh, chips. And there's even a prize. A pool noodle. Cool. And it's a big one, too. Wow. It'll go great with our other pool noodle. Hmm. Oh, you got a little something. Got it. Aww. Now let's twist it up into some twine. We can use it to cover up the noodles. And make a brand new hey. cat tree. Doesn't fit? Hmm. Well, then make it fit. And add some decorations, too. Ooh, how does your garden grow? And I think Kitty's in love. Well, someone's got cat scratch fever. A paw print? Let's fill it up with glue. And throw on some beads. And glitter. Lots and lots of glitter. Almost done. Look, there's a heart underneath. And it's time to cut the cake. Clean it up. And it's the perfect pendant for our new cat collar. Now grab a bunch of cat tails. They're always there to lend a hand. Ah, clean laundry. Perfect place to sit. Ew. If only you didn't leave so much fur. Well, make like a cat and lick it. Kind of a weird aftertaste, huh? Hey, what's in the pipe? A pipe cleaner. <laughs> Makes sense. Let's bend it up. It can be a kitty back scratcher. Takes care of loose hair, too. Hmm. Flowers will really brighten the room. Or, as kitty prefers, the floor. Naughty kitty, how are we going to replace that vase? A doll's head? Why not? Hollow it out and add paint. It's amazing what a little fresh coat can do. Now take some pieces of sausage and stack them together. For a pepperoni rosette. Now make a bouquet, in case Kitty gets hungry. <laughs> the 
sky is oozing. Ew. Wait, no, it's just gum. Aww. We need to do something about this. Hmm. But we're going to need a little support. Like some handy dandy Cintapon. Use it to cover all this gum. It sure sticks. Now for some lights and some slinkies. Ew. I think we need to make Kitty their very own litter box. Ew, yuck. First, grab an old box. Wow. Carve out an opening on top. Why not make it a TV? We got the box. Now we need the litter. Here, kitty, try it out. Don't forget to wash your paws. Ooh, looks like we've got some company. While you're here, why not hang out? Here, you can hold the toilet paper for us. Okay, it's time to show Kitty the big surprise. I think it's time for Kitty to do a little exploring. And that's not all. We've got a few more surprises. Told you Kitty loves fish. And Pomni, too. Hold on. Someone's coming in. Quick, hide! Good thing Kitty's great at hiding. Don't worry. The cat always comes back. Because you're what Kitty loves best. <laughs> 